Today we're going to be taking a look at some new tools from Platypod that you can use for tabletop and product photography. Today we're going to be talking about tabletop photography and some uh, interesting new items that are out in the marketplace that you may or may not have seen. They're made by Platypod. The first thing I'm going to show you is these gooseneck stackable mounts which fit right on your Platypod Ultra or your Platypod Max. And also with this tabletop kit that they sell is the Lytra Torch 2.0. And this is a great little um, light that goes with this kit that's used for tabletop photography for, for things that are in close. And before we get started and, and kind of show you some of the features um, that these have, I want to talk a little bit about tabletop photography because it's something that a lot of people are starting to do now with more products out in the marketplace and they need to be photographed and people want videos of that. One of the things that we have challenge-wise is that we're working in a very small contained space and a lot of the typical lighting instruments and apparatus that we use to shape the light is, is too big to get in. And so you need something that's small enough that you can work with. And so that's one of the things that I'd like to share about why I think this is such a great kit and why you might want to consider buying it. So let's open up the box. Um, this is pretty straightforward. These just kind of pop out of the plastic. It's uh, not one of these things where you need a, a giant machete to open the plastic container that they come in. There's two of these arms that come with this kit, and they're about 12 inches long, and they're very, very flexible. There's uh, little options for um, a quarter-inch thread on the bottom of these, and they screw right into your platypod. Max, which I have conveniently located right here, and I'll show you how that works. Now, one of the other things, too, is that these... Um, these can be mounted either on the front or the back of the platypod. And that's really kind of a nice thing because sometimes, you know, you might have a really wide angle shot and the flex arms might get in the way if you want to move the thing around. So these are completely flexible, as you can see, which is kind of nice. And the other thing that I really like about the, uh, the platypod Ultra is that a lot of times I'll use this as a little light stand for the, for the, um, to put lights on. And so this is great. I can just screw this into the platypod Ultra and move that around so in case I want to turn this light on and maybe I want to uh, have a backlight on it, I can use it traditionally like I use my regular lighting where I can use a backlight or a side light. So they're not just for mounting lights on the front, they're for moving, you know, you can position these and mount them to anything. It's a quarter inch 20 thread that's on there. There's three different positions for this light. There's a low, medium, and then the high, and there's also a little strobe factor that's on there, which I don't know what you would use that for, but somebody will. And this little diffuser lamp, which is really nice, that comes on and off and it really softens the light. So if you wanted to use this in a really strong way, you could just turn this up to the highest position, which is 8,000 lumens, which is really, really a lot of light. These are waterproof and they're 97 CRI and they are balanced for 5,700 degrees Kelvin. Thanks again for tuning in today. I hope that you found that this information was helpful and that you can use these tools and techniques to move forward with your product and your tabletop photography. Be sure to check out platypod.com to see their full line of products. And if you like what you see here, please like and subscribe below. Thanks again. We'll see you soon.